Look at this cute little book! Is it still a good size to draw inside? Hell yeah! First time I saw someone drawing in a super tiny sketchbook like this was the artist Kenneth Rockerford. He started with an A6 sketchbook to challenge himself to draw every day and now his most recent small sketchbook is not bigger than a Lego figure. It's super amazing and as I found this small sketchbook at the Flying Tiger store, I wanted to challenge myself as well. Especially because I missed the time when I had enough time every day to fill my sketchbooks. And it's easier to fill a sketchbook every day if it's tiny like this. I think it can be easier to start filling a small sketchbook with drawings than starting off with a bigger one. It's like having the pressure to fill all these big empty pages and especially to continue drawing inside if you didn't fill the previous page properly. For the most people it's normal to do something in a chronological order. And if this order fails at a point, we don't like to continue. It's just normal and that's why a sketchbook can help us to get over it. So starting with a small sketchbook can help us to fill pages faster and because you fill it faster it feels like a reward. You have done something, you have finished it off. And if you're still afraid to fill the first page, just start somewhere in the middle or just splash some coffee over it and try to create something new out of this mess. Sometimes if you buy a new sketchbook, you will get that magical feeling like ah, it's so new, I need to draw something great inside. But with coffee, this magic is over and you're ready to mess around. That's what a sketchbook is there for. To do mistakes, to try other things out and to be free. A tiny sketchbook can inspire you to create other things and boost your creativity because of the size or um, to even get you out of your comfort zone. It's also good to get a lot of thumbnails done and it fits in every bag. So I hope you enjoyed this tiny video. Thank you so much for watching and stay creative. Bye bye!